everybody, this micro coaching is designed to enable all of us to better navigate and win the AI race. It's based on the interview we just hosted with Kevin Roos, the world renowned New York Times writer, who also recently published a book on how we can best future proof our roles and organizations as artificial intelligence gets ever more capable in supporting us. According to Kevin, there are two critical strategies that we need to get right in order to best navigate the developments with AI. The first one is all about efficiency. The second one is all about humanity. So the efficiency side, and this is the one we've heard so much about nonstop. How do we do what we do better, simpler, cheaper, and faster in our roles as we interact with our colleagues, the way we deliver to our customers. The issue is if we focus so much on that, we may forget the fact that what human beings value the most is the human touch. And that's where we need the human strategy. Kevin shares the example of how a DVD player these days costs $50, despite the fact that it has so many lasers, moving parts, and thousands and thousands of components. Compare that to a clay pot that could fetch hundreds, if not thousands of dollars, depending on which artisan created it with their own hands. There is something about human fingerprints that we value tremendously as human beings. So. The question becomes, how can we do everything that we do with an increasing human touch, whether it's what we do together with our colleagues in terms of the work effort we put in, whether it's about the service or product we provide to our customers or the impact we have on our stakeholders. As AI frees us up from automatable tasks, how can we leverage some of that freed up time to really lean in to the human connection and the human impact? that everybody craves so much. We can all now stream music for next to no cost, but to go to a concert and see it in live, surrounded by human beings, now that costs a lot more. The same dynamic is about to play out in all different industries. And no matter what our roles may be, no matter what products and services we offer, we cannot afford to not get this right. So one, how do we make sure we become more efficient? How do we get everyone in our organization to embrace that efficiency? And how do we best couple that with the critical importance of human touch? And how do we empower everyone to think deeply about how they can bring their own humanity and leave their fingerprints in everything that they do and that they put out into the world? Let's be the kind of force that helps everybody do this right to get these strategies right, both of them, the efficiency and the humanity. And let's exchange ideas on how we can best support each other as the ongoing developments with AI keep rolling out. I can't wait to see not just hacks on how to use AI better for more efficiency, but also the elevated approaches in which we can all treat each other in a more human, more valued, deeply connected way. Love to hear from you on how you implement this. And I highly encourage you to check out the full conversation with Kevin on ivy.com. It's great seeing you today. And I hope to see you again very soon. Take care.